Mr. Westerman, you are recognized. Uh, Mr. Mast, you are recognized. Thank you, Madam Chairwoman. I appreciate it. Uh, Mr. Secretary, thank you for being with us. I wonder if, if as, as a part of infrastructure, we can get you broadband. <laughs> I don't know if you can get As if to prove the point, I'm having a little trouble hearing you, but uh, uh, yeah, it's a reminder of how far we've got to go. We'll try to work our we'll try to work our way through it. Uh, listen, I uh, I've enjoyed hearing the testimony. You've you've made it very clear that environmental justice is a top priority for the the infrastructure package. You've spoke about it uh, in terms of climate change and, and rising oceans, uh, and you just testified to Mr. Bost just a few minutes ago uh, that waterway infrastructure does fit into the president's agenda. Um, and I was glad to hear you speak about that as well. I wanted to ask a little bit more specifically on that. Would you say that improving water quality uh, is a component of achieving the administration's environmental justice goals? Certainly. Uh, if you can't take for granted that you can get a glass of clean, safe drinking water uh, out of a tap uh, when you're starting your day, that your family is going to be safe, uh, then that wrecks uh, so many other things in, in, in your life. And so we've got to make sure everyone can count on, on superior water quality. Absolutely. And, and, you know, we've seen issues in Flint and other places, not just terms of, in terms of drinking water, but also water that goes into the communities and homes, uh, the backyards, the, the canals, the, the estuaries and other places. Would you say that that will be a critical component to achieving the administration's environmental justice? Certainly. Very good. Just glad to hear it as simply as it could be said. Um, do you also agree that water quality infrastructure, uh, maybe as it relates to say Everglades infrastructure, that could be an example, uh, um, should be a feature in the administration infrastructure package? Uh, certainly uh, all, all areas of the country need to be served well. I, I want to take care that I'm, I might be wandering out of my lane a little bit, knowing that uh, a lot of the water uh, waterways or a U.S. Army you know, Corps of Engineers matter. But uh, certainly the, the administration as a whole cares a lot about this. And to the extent this does touch on Department of Transportation equities, we're eager to support that. Yes, I don't appreciate that. I have to help you uh, view. <laughs> so, you know, you're. Um, so in that, I know I do appreciate uh, your candidness with my with my questions just much. And this is opinion, and and it's uh, I understand that it's not exactly your lane, but it's important for somebody at your level uh, in the administration. And to just ask them that the federal government has a right what to poison its citizens. Could I ask you to say that one more time? I'm sorry, you broke up again. Absolutely. I was to, to follow on with this in the same line of questioning. Uh, do you believe that the federal government has any right whatsoever to poison its citizens? Of course not. Thank you for your testimony. And Madam Chairwoman, I yield back. Uh, the gentleman yields. Uh, I